My name's Luke Barbetti. I'm the Underground Mining Manager at Newmont's Tanami Operation. So my role is to oversee and coordinate all the underground activities uh, related to production, including people and uh, budgets and equipment movements. So right now we're about 900 metres below the surface at the uh, underground workshop. So in here we service a lot of our underground equipment uh, so we can get it back to work as quick as possible. Yeah, so safety is number one. So our people are our most important thing here on site. So for us, it's really critical that we don't start a single job or we stop a job if we feel the safety controls aren't in place. Tanami are very much at the forefront of innovation, whether it's through our DSS fatigue monitoring systems to, to make sure that we're managing fatigue across our fleet, through to our MindStar system that helps us manage our operations more closely. We can have live feedback on how equipment and operators are performing. The nodes that we wear on our belt help us when we're working around heavy equipment to, to make sure our people are visible and, and safe. We've got almost 20% female representation within our group uh, and we have everyone here from the industry, uh, from different cultural backgrounds, people who have been in the industry for five minutes and people who have been in the industry for over 30 years. So there's really a place for everyone within mining uh, and certainly a place for everyone at Tanami Underground. So underground mining, uh, just purely by the name of it, we're approximately working at one and a half kilometres underground at the deepest areas of the mine. That brings its own challenges, so uh, we need to really focus on uh, water, air supply, uh, underground to ensure that we can continue operations. The TU2 project is a shaft that will allow us to pull dirt vertically from the bottom of the mine uh, directly to the surface. So it allows us to deconstrain the mine and it gives us an additional 150 to 200,000 ounces a year of uh, product. In our development areas, our underground jumbos, our sand big machines, we use them to ground support. So we support the excavation when we open it and then they drill the face in front of us so we can blast it out. Following blasting it out, we have a fleet of Caterpillar 2900 loaders. We're bringing in a fleet of 2900 XE loaders, which are our hybrid machines. They're responsible for loading the dirt out of the development heading so we can progress. If we're going to have a sustainable operation going into the future, we, we really need to be future facing. And this could be around our technology or even just our environmental impact going forward. 